So I'm riding on my moped, as you can see, my moped. I'm uh, riding along the highway. And I see this guy. I'm sure a lot of you who live here in Kona have seen this guy on uh, Queen Kaahu Manu Highway on the side of the road with the orange bucket and he's picking up trash. And I've seen this guy many times. And I always wondered, hmm, what's the deal? What's the story with this guy? You know, he's always parked his uh, car on the side of the road and he's picking up trash. So as I was driving this morning, just now, I seen a guy on the side of the road picking up trash. So I'm gonna, I turn around and I'm gonna go down there. I'm gonna talk to him, find out his story, what's the deal. You know, I'm just, seem like a nice guy on the side of the road, picking up trash. So I'm gonna go down there, he's down there right now. With his car. And I'm gonna go talk right with him. I hope he's okay with, uh, hope he's okay with me, uh, filming him but well, we'll find out in a minute or so I'm gonna go down there right now and talk to the guy right down there that's his car right here Uh, I see you all the time. Yeah, yeah. On the side of the road, sometimes you're in the medium over there. Yeah, yeah. Picking up trash with your orange bucket. So, orange, so I said, one day when I'm driving by, if I see you, I'm gonna stop and talk to you and find out what's your story. I think you're so cool. Hey. What you do? Uh, I just get tired of looking at the garbage bro. Hold on, let me turn yeah, this up. Yeah. You mind if I, I, I'm making a video. I like put you on video this way. Is that, is that okay? Uh, no, I mean, you just, yeah, just... but it's not about me, it's about... Yeah, I just, I just, see, I want you to find out your stories. Like, why is this guy picking up trash? Because I don't see anybody doing it like you do. I don't see anybody else doing it. Well, uh, yeah. And I see your car park all the time, either down there or by, you know, over here. Well, Sometimes you're in a center down there. Right, right. I, I started at uh, Kmart. My name's Irvin. Irvin? Yeah, Irvin. Yeah, I R V I N. Irvin. Exactly. I'm yeah. Kavika. Kavika? Yeah. Oh, I got a good friend of mine. His name's Kavika. No kidding. Yeah, he's a little younger than you are, though. Oh, yeah? yeah. So I know there's a lot of trash. Right, right. I, so you just pick up as much as you can for the day? Uh, yeah, I usually, uh, you know, I, I, I get anywhere from, I don't know, six, seven, eight hours, sometimes only four hours. Uh, you still get seven, uh, eight, eight hours sometimes? Yeah, sometimes I get out here at nine, ten o'clock, and then I work until, well, when the sun goes down. You know, because I can't see, plus it starts getting mm -hmm. dangerous. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. know, especially if I'm in the middle. Right, uh, right, right When right, the right. sun starts setting, you know, I don't want people to... Right. You know, get crazy or nothing like that there, but... So how much bags or... You like so you, far, you uh, so far I've gotten like 47 bags. Bro. Today? No, not today. I, I average anywhere from four to eight. Four to eight? Four to eight bags a, a, a day. Um, like today, you know, I, I got a doctor's appointment at 2.15, so, you know, about 1.30 I'll quit. And okay. then, uh, yeah. So one day you just decided to see all that trash, tired of seeing the trash, you decided to, hmm, uh, no, I'm gonna actually, stop and pick uh, up the trash? Uh, actually, Kavika, I've done this in 49 different states. You kidding me? No, no, I'm, I'm serious. I got a, uh, oh my I God. travel, that vehicle, I've been traveling around America for, uh, since uh, 2008 or nine, something like that, but I picked up trash. But here, because I live here, right, and I'm driving by it, I'm tired of seeing it, um, so you know. You decide to do something about it. I, I decide to do something <laughs> about it. Um, I do believe in creation. Absolutely. So sure. when I woke up this morning, it's like, okay, uh, you know, how are you going to use me today? And uh, you know, he's well. You got a doctor's appointment. And you got this appointment. Why don't you go pick up some trash? I'm like, okay. <laughs> wow, that, that, um, that is so cool. I think it's very inspiring. You know, I can see somebody. I, I, total stranger, I don't know you, but now I know you, you're Irvin. So I can put a name to the guy on the side of the road who's doing something. Right, because, right. you know, a lot of people are there. They see this cool guy. I'm 
they don't know your name, but now yeah. you can put a name to the guy, and yes. which is so cool. I think that is, you know. Yeah, so, but again, Urban, everybody, it is Urban. Yeah, yeah. This is so cool. Yeah, but I, now when people try to do something like that, I tell them my name is Matthews Six. And you know what that is, right, Kavika? No. In the Bible, Matthew 6 says, if you do a good deed, don't go out and boast about it. No, see, you didn't. I came to you. Right, right. I agree with you, bro. <laughs> yeah, you didn't yeah, yeah. say nothing. You didn't yeah. want to say, um, you know, so. Yeah, you know, and, and, and I, like I said, I've done this in 49 states. I got pictures of me all around America doing this. But when you're walking through your neighborhood, or you're driving down the road, or you're going into one of the stores, and you see garbage, the first human reaction is, oh, man, look what that, man, somebody ought to pick that up. Real Hawaiian Pono is when we look at the garbage, our first reaction should be, let me pick that up. Just pick it up, right. Yeah, so I've been driving by this for four years, and it's yeah. like, I want to, I want to, I want I said, okay, I'm, I'm going to start right in my own neighborhood, you know, because I live right here in Kona, so. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, yeah. Like I said, I, I started at K Marks, I, I got all the way down to Pine Tree, and now we're making Make that. Making a loop, huh? Yeah. So yeah. What, are you retired? What, what? No, I'm not retired. Uh, I'm a barber. Uh, no yeah, I've been doing it for 41 years. I'm, I'm, again, it's a gift God gave me to cut hair and so stuff. So you do your own thing on this, uh, as a barber? No. Uh, what it is, uh, Kavika. Yeah. Right? But I go to physical therapy. It's like, come on. One, two, three, three. <laughs> here. One, two, three. So, you know, and that's why I'm out here so much. Because, like, right now I can't work to make a living. Because I'm uh, uh, from the because trees. of the injury. Yeah, uh, the neck and then uh, uh, one hit me in the shoulder and blew my shoulder. Believe it or not, I'm doing this in a lot of pain, but I'm alive and, and I, I, so, I, I, yeah, I, I, you know, so it, it's keep by keeping it moving. I, I'm not right. The thing is, you have to keep your razor, but you got to keep moving. You cannot. Right. If I, if I lay in bed, I'm going to gain 50 yes. more pounds, yeah. and I'm going to be, you know, I can't do that. So, I, so I'm not able to work. So this just gives me the time to do wow. that and, and a few other things that I do. Yeah. It's very admirable what you're doing, you know. Like, I gotta ask you, your paint job on your car. Okay. Who did that? You did that? Yeah, yeah. I've done that to every vehicle for 22 years. Um, what it is, it's a tribute to our America. It's a tribute to our soldiers and their families. Yes. Uh, uh, I, I traveled again, 49 states. I go to uh, military bases. Are you a veteran? Uh, I'm a free American. Yeah. I'm, I'm a I'm a man that gets to be yeah. born and live in America. Look at all the Absolutely, privileges. Absolutely, I hear you, man. I, 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 I know. I was, I was in the military. I'm a veteran. My brother's a veteran. My nephew's a veteran. You know. Okay. So, but well, anyway, this is Irvin. I was talking talk story with Irvin and uh, <laughs> good man, very inspiring. I love his story, and he does. You know what nobody else does. He does this by himself on his own time, whenever he can, and he picks up the trash. That's how I've seen him. Couple of I've seen him several times. So if you see Irvin on the side of the road. Give him a shotgun. Give him a shotgun. <laughs> Pop your heart and Aloha. Hello, brother. Thank you. Kavika. Yes. Thank you. Urban Amen. from the side of Queen K. Yeah. <laughs> Good man here. Good man. <laughs>